Hi everyone, welcome to Science Tutorial for You. My name is Candy and in this video I'm going to teach you how to define isotope in three different ways. And the example that I'm going to use will be carbon-12 and carbon-14. Okay, let's start with the basic one. Number one, isotopes are atoms containing the same number of protons, but different number of neutron. So please remember you don't have to include the number of electron at all. Just mention it has the same number of protons but different number of neutrons. So simply proton number the same but neutron number is different. Definition number two Isotopes are atoms having the same atomic number, but the mass number is different. So in this definition, atomic number is same and mass number is different and obviously mass number is the number of proton number and mass number is the number of proton plus neutron and the last definition which is similar to the first definition isotopes are same element but having different number of neutrons. The third example is similar to the first one but over here they are the same element. Obviously same element contains the same number of protons. Okay, Let's do the example of carbon-12 and carbon-14. Carbon-12 and carbon-14. The number 12 and number 14 refers to the mass number. So it can be written as 12 on the top, which is mass number, and then 6 at the bottom, which is the atomic number. Same over here, 14 and then 6. And the 6 is the atomic number. Like I mentioned before, atomic number is the number of protons. So in this case, carbon 12 and carbon 14 contains the atomic number of 6. So proton number is 6 and 6. The protons and neutron for this carbon, the proton number and neutron number add up to 14 for this carbon. So the number of neutron has to be 8. And for this carbon, the protons and neutrons add up to 12, but the proton is 6. So neutron number is 6. So we can see that proton number is same. But a neutron number is different. Okay, so this is how you define isotope in three different ways. And if you have any question, ask me in the comments below. And please do subscribe and share it with your friend. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Thank you.